What's up YouTube? Here it is. I just seen a video on how to make your own acrylic with chalk. I need to check it out because if this is a thing, I'm going to have so much fun making so many different colors. Um, I've seen a few people do it and I just have to try it. I have to try it myself. I gotta see it. I gotta see it. I gotta see it. I gotta see it. So, um, I picked this pink. It's really pretty. Pink. You can't really go wrong with pink. But, you know. Some people don't like paint, just pick another color, but I'm going to choose paint. Let's see. Put this thing on. Don't put it on too high. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I'll put it down. Dust going everywhere. Okay. Oh, I said okay. From the videos I've seen, they were just like, you don't need to put much because you don't want it to be like too chalky. Which I agree, I do not want any chalky acrylic. It's gonna drive me nuts. Okay, you know, I'm just gonna do that. It's gonna take a little too it's gonna take too long. Okay. I don't need much because I'm just checking it out. Using Mia Secret Clear. This is some good acrylic. I love Mia Secret Clear. I tried other clear acrylics like um Kiss and just some beginner acrylic, you know, but and it was okay, but I really prefer me a secret. Once I tried, I was like, oh yeah, I'm gonna stick to this. This is my jam. Okay, and you can see it's still kind of chalky. So I'm gonna take my e-file. I'm gonna try to stir it up. Hopefully it won't like fly everywhere. Oh getting a little dusty. I don't know if you guys can see it on the camera. It's got like this little smoke effect going on. Maybe next time, like I'll just use like a dipper, a deeper cup or something. Yeah, I'll use a different cup. Last. Okay. It's really pretty. See, I didn't use much at all. Oh my goodness. It's really pretty. And I'm trying to make sure there's like no chalk chunks in here. I do not want to have any chalk chunks in the acrylic. I want this to be smooth. Smooth pigment. Okay. I think this would be real helpful too for people who like, um, you know how you use your, your white gel polish and you want to put like some pigment on top? But then, you know, you have to use your acrylic all the time. So maybe this would be like an alternative. Be like, hey, I'm just going to mix some chalk up in a little clear acrylic and do that. So, you know, I think that'd be cool. Okay. I'm really just having fun. That was fun. Okay. No, I'll have this little practice finger. I already got a nail on it. And I just, like I said, I'm just doing this. I just want to check it out. Look at that. It's so pretty. It's really pretty. Goodness. And you see, I didn't use that much chalk. And you see how pink it is? So I guess, like, if you want a softer color, you, like, use less chalk and add, like, a little white acrylic if you have any. Or you could just use a little white chalk, you know. Let's check this out, you guys. All right. Oh, it's pretty. It's like clear. Let's see. It's like a clear pink. Like a jelly, you know? People use jelly nails and stuff. It's real pretty. I'm using my um, number 10, so I didn't really pick up a big bead. I, these practice things are kind of small. So I wanted, didn't want to pick up like a really huge bead when I was just checking this out. Okay. Oh yeah. It's not chalky, you guys. It's really not. It's, 
that's really nice. I love this. I love this matte pad. Look at that. It's so pretty. It's so pretty. Look at that. It's like a hot girl summer pink girl. Like, stop playing with me. It's jelly. It's like a jelly pink. You know, it's kind of see through, but if you want to keep like applying, I guess you could see like it comes more of a solid color, not clear. Okay. I'm really happy that turned out. I want to try something else. So, boom. I had like some glitter some like some type of arts and craft i got this from dollar tree and um i was just like oh my goodness i could do this with acrylic and i want to check it out so i'm going to put like some glitter that's a lot of glitter hopefully that's like not too much but we're going to check it out Free. I think I did put too much glitter in it. Like I said, we're just checking stuff out. Learn from my mistakes. You see, I put too much glitter in it. When you do it, don't put too much. It's better if you measure it out. If you get you like a little teaspoon, tablespoon, or whatever, how much you're going to use, do that. Don't just be like me and just pour stuff in willy nilly. Unless you just got the the special power of like, you know, just knowing how much to do without needing to measure and kind of like cooking, you know, you know, when to stop adding seasoning, <laughs> you don't need measuring cups. Anyway, okay, so boom, you can see a lot of glitter in that. I hope I didn't mess it up. Let's see. It's super glittery. Let's see what it looks like. It's pretty. I like it. Oh, it's really pretty. I'm getting like princess vibes. Princess and pink vibes. It does not mess up the acrylic like I'm picking up really good beads you guys I'm not like having any problems it's really glittery though it's a lot of glitter but hey So don't put as much as I did. Like, like I said, just might have to play with it. Cause I think glitter goes a long way. Let's see. Yeah, evidently Chardin just put too much. Okay, so um, yeah, this is what it looks like. It's really pretty. I don't know if you can see. Maybe it's better like that. It's pretty though. I like it. I'm so happy I did this. This is cool. I'm gonna have so much fun. You guys are probably gonna see me making like a whole bunch of colors. And um, yeah, that's awesome. I'm gonna be doing that. I kind of like. Like I said, I put a lot of glitter in it. You guys, I didn't. That was not the intention but it is all good it still looks good yeah how those people do it there <laughs> okay you guys 
Well, that worked out. Oh my goodness, I caught my hand and glitter went everywhere. <laughs> okay, anyway, that worked. We're going to be doing more of that. Um, check it out yourself. I hope you guys had fun watching my video. See you in the next one. Bye, bye.